Hello everyone and welcome back to our new video tutorial of hybrid mobile application for WooCommerce platform based web stores. Basically, this app converts your website into a hybrid app. This app uses a theme of a website and can be downloadable from a Google Play Store. It provides a view of a website to the customers and also allows our customers to do shopping from a smart device within the customer's hand. This app is much more advanced than the other apps. But before I proceed further, can you do subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for further updates from our end. And if you do like the video, kindly give it a thumbs up. Now, what a customer needs to do is to install the app from a Google Play Store in case of an Android device and from an iOS store in case of an iOS device. So now, as you can see, I'm having an Android device in my hand in which I have already installed the app from the Google Play Store. Once you install the app from the Google Play Store, this icon will gonna appear on your home screen. For entering the app, we need to tap on the app. Once you enter the app, you're gonna see the shop page. And on the right side above corner, you can see the menu option is there. Click on the menu option. Here you can see all the options like home, cart, checkout, my account, shop and upcoming events. And also the options which you have added from the backend, you can see those options here itself. Now we'll, we'll tap on the cart option. If you have added any product in the cart, you'll gonna see those products in the cart options. Right now, we don't have any product in the cart. That's why this option is empty right now. Next option is checkout. The next one is my account. Tap on the my account option. Here you're gonna see the details of the customer and from where you need to log in or you can register from your email address as well. Right now, we are having the details of a customer for this demo purpose you need to enter the customer username and the password here itself then you need to tap on the login option once you logged in you'll see this page here the dashboard orders downloads addresses account details and logout options will appear from the dashboard option You can see this page itself. Then on the orders option, you can see the products which you have ordered earlier as well. And in the downloads option, you can see the products you have downloaded on your panel. And in the addresses option, once you tap on the addresses option, you'll gonna see the billing address and the shipping address itself. Next is account details. Once you tap on the account details, you'll gonna see the details of the account, like your first name, last name, display name, email address. You can even change your password by tapping your password in current password, new password, then confirm new password, and you need to save the changes. Then you can save the changes and change your password. If you want to log out, then you can tap on the log out option and you can log out from the page. So now again, move back towards menu option. And next option is shop. Tap on the shop option. Once you tap on the shop option, you're gonna see all the products which are there. Here, as you can see, the products which are available will appear here itself. Like you are tapping on the Benny with logo once you tap on the product, you'll gonna see the details related to the product like the price, the product type and the quantity which you want to enter. You can even enter the quantity. And the descriptions as well will gonna appear here itself. If you want to add the product to cart, you need to click on the add to cart option. Once you tap on the add to cart option, you're gonna see the product will gonna appear on the cart option. 
From here, you can tap on the view cart option. After tapping on the cart option, you will see the product, price, quantity, subtotal. If you want to apply any kind of coupon, you can also apply from here itself. Cart totals, shipping details. Now you can proceed to checkout. In the checkout option, you're gonna see the details, billing details like first name, last name, company name, country, street addresses, town, state, pin code, phone. The details related to billing, you can see here itself and your order as well. <clears throat> now you need to choose a payment option. Whatever suits you, you can choose for that. I am choosing cash on delivery option. Now move to place order. Once you tap on the place order, once you tap on the place order, you'll gonna see the order received. Your order has been received. Now the details of the orders you'll gonna see here. Billing address, shipping address. If you want to see the orders, you can click on the menu option. Then again, the my account option. On the my account option, you can tap on the orders. And in the orders, you can see the product which you have ordered, the details of the product when you have ordered, the status, total money, actions, the date, Everything will gonna visible of the orders related details here itself. Now, the next option is you can click on the checkout as well. Here you can see there is no checkout is available right now. That's why this option is empty. You can also click on cart option. Now return to shop. If you want to add a new product or if you want to purchase a new product, you can add from the, from the shopping page itself. Now, as you can see on the bottom side, there are three options. If you tap on the first option, that is account option. You will gonna see the details related to my account. Here again, the details of dashboard, orders, downloads, addresses, account details and logout option is appear. Next option is search option. If you want to search any product, you can write the name of the product and then click on the search. Once you search the product, the product will gonna appear on the screen. The next option is cart. If you add any product in the cart, then that product will gonna appear on the cart option as you can see here itself. This product has been added into the cart and you can see the details and if you want to proceed with the checkout option, you can click on the proceed to checkout and then you can place your order itself. And if you want to see the details related to my account, you can click on the my account option and you can see the details. And if you want to edit as well, your name, your address or anything, you can change your address, your name from here, my account option in the account details. From here, you can change the name, address or anything, whatever, want to, whatever you want to change. And then you can save the changes the account details will gonna update accordingly. And now you need to log out from the panel. Just need, just tap on the logout option and then you can log out from the panel. So now that was much about the hybrid mobile application for WooCommerce platform based web stores from my end. And still, if you have any query, any doubt or suggestions, you can reach back to us at support at or you can raise a ticket at webcool.uvdesk.com. Lastly, thanks for watching the video. Have a good day ahead.